Spain is the favorite playground for mega hits like Star Wars, Westworld, Game of Thrones and The Eternals. I'm Antoinetta, welcome to my channel. Today I will discuss why Spain might become the new Hollywood. There's some crazy developments that will transform completely the Spanish audiovisual industry. And how is Spain planning to do that? The government plans to allocate 1.9 billion dollars to boost the audiovisual sector in Spain. And these are not only tax incentives, they also are working on creating a very easy bureaucratic path to gaining permits and licenses to crew and talent. This is completely reshaping the landscape in Spain. The American giant Netflix opened its first European production hub near Madrid in 2019. Now they're doubling their sound stages from 5 to 10 and also upgrading all their editing and technology post-production facilities. Spain has extremely diverse locations for filming. Spain can replicate over 70% of the world locations. going to Spain, in my head, the only place to film was the City of Arts and Sciences. It's just stunning architecture. It really gives me an opportunity to really give the show some scope. Traveling by road, you can see different landscapes, architecture, and different cultures, which can resemble pretty much any part of the world. One very famous Emmy Award winning series, The Crown, were filmed in Andalusia. Netflix filmed the most expensive second season, more expensive even than Game of Thrones, in Malaga. One of the images with most impact in season four was filmed on top of the Palacio Hotel in Malaga, resembling a skyscraper in Brisbane, Australia. Another part of the plan, it's tax incentives, of course. Before, there was a limit on how much a foreign production company can spend so they can get the maximum deduction benefits. Now, this has changed and there will be full movies filmed in Spain as well as full seasons of TV series. A world-famous production company, one of the biggest companies, will invest almost 362 million euros in filming 33 series and 18 films in the Canary Islands, the Balearic Islands, Madrid, Andalusia, Catalonia, and Valencia. Talent. Talent indeed, it's beginning to mark Spain's apart. After the huge success of the Netflix series Money Heist and Elite, which topped the charts for the most binged shows on the network, Spain is really setting the pillar of growth in the industry for talent. They're putting gender equality and censorship also on the paper. There has been a long debate over nine months in Turkey over a Turkish TV series, if only. The Turkish government didn't allow them to film the series in Turkey because of a gay character. Netflix has picked Spain to complete the series right here. If you wonder what Doctor Who, Tomorrowland and Westworld have in common, this is it. There's nothing better that can translate sleek, utopian architecture than the arts and sciences complex here in Valencia. This was the place where Charlotte got off an eccentric helicopter right here, leaving the hemispheric as the perfect backdrop behind her. And Westworld was not the only series filmed by the HBO giant here in Spain. The most famous show, Game of Thrones, took place in many historic locations like Navarra, Girona, Andalusia, Castellón, Cordoba. The filming of Game of Thrones put Osuna 
a very small town on the map for so many fans. I found a very interesting fact that the bull ring where this famous scene was filmed in Osuna was given for free to the production. They didn't have to pay a dime for, for shooting at the bull ring. But what was so important was the 17 minutes this scene really transformed the city. The citizens, their tourism really boosted. They created even different tapas named after certain scenes and characters from Game of Thrones. This is the effect a crazy big production can have on the tourism and the economic impact on a small city like Osuna. The requirements made by the international production companies are very high. Of course, they're looking for cost-effective, great talent, high-tech, easily accessible locations, perfect transportation, hotels, and there are not very many countries that check that box. Spain, it's one of them. What's new? Exciting new movie by Wes Anderson. Started already filming near Madrid, featuring many, many superstars like Bill Murray, Tilda Swinton, Scarlett Johansson, and more. Wes Anderson is famous for being very picky and he's a great professionalist, of course. He lived in Europe for many years but he has chosen Spain for several factors. Of course, the landscape, easy transportation, great cast, production value, and other matters related to the ease of filming a quality movie. On his official visit in Los Angeles, talking to the biggest companies in Hollywood, the Prime Minister of Spain, Pedro Sanchez, claimed that he's aiming to turn Spain into the next Hollywood in Europe. The audiovisual sector has gone through a global revolution in the past years. The digital transformation, the new business model, and the new technology have drastically transformed the way we produce and consume content. And strengthening the Spanish audiovisual industry will push Spain forward, so much forward that it will likely become the new Hollywood. This is it. I hope you liked it. Click like and subscribe and I will see you in my next one. Ciao.